Palm Beach County Sheriff's deputies are searching for someone who shot a boy. That's right. The shooting happened this afternoon right near John I. Leonard High School in Green Acres, putting the school there on code yellow lockdown for a time, even though the shooting had nothing to do with the school is a preponderance of caution. WPTV News Channel 5's Dave Bowman. He's live at the scene of the shooting with new information tonight. Dave. Shannon Kelly right now crime scene techs are at the scene gathering clues and beginning the process of wrapping up the investigation into the shooting that took place here at the parking lot of the dedicated senior medical center right across the street from the high school. That shooting actually happened just a few minutes after school let out for the day. As sheriff's deputies remain at the scene gathering clues, we have learned it was a teenage boy who was shot and was conscious when taken to a local hospital. Steve Escal was just getting out of his car for a doctor's appointment at the facility. And all of a sudden while I was walking, I heard a gunshot. I never heard a gunshot before. I'm thinking maybe it could be a firecracker, but I see a kid laying down on the ground and all of a sudden a bunch of kids going all over the place. I didn't know where the shooter was. So I just ran inside there and uh, automatically they put the place on lockdown. Dave Bowman reporting. He says a doctor and nurse from the hospital actually attended to that wounded boy until the paramedics came to take him to the hospital. The shooter, according to the sheriff's office, has not been taken into custody. John A. Leonard High it was placed on code yellow, as Shannon mentioned, for students who stayed after school. According to school board officials, parents of those students were called immediately.